And let me show y'all my mystery squash. This squash goes all the way back there to the house, which is about 10 to 12 feet. Comes here. Um, I found this squash growing right there along that ditch on the outside of the fence. And that's not my property, that's the city drainage um, ditch easement. So I pulled it and there were two of them. I brought them and I planted them. One died, this one survived. Um, this was last year. And look, this is just one of the pumpkins that it has made. I don't know. I have been researching to see what type of pumpkins they are. I have already harvested three fruit from this pumpkin vine. And I have five more. This is the most recently pollinated one. Um, it's a cross between a kombucha. But yeah, this one is the next one that's ready to be harvested but i'm going to try and leave them on the vine as long as possible and yeah i actually tasted the fruit they are not bad they don't have a strong flavor at all similar to kombucha they're not dry um the texture isn't stringy so yeah you could just roast them or boil them and mash them up and they would take on the flavor of anything that you cook with them.